I'm Titanium Mike, and I want you to join the APA. Along with my friend and business partner, Cedo5, I started the Apollo Protection Agency several years ago because I wanted to help people. People needed an affordable option for their security needs, whether it be a personal security detail, ensuring the safe transport of goods and valuables, or providing safe passage to Avalon for a fair and unbiased trial. And who better to provide that service than the toughest VISC anyone's ever seen? So now we look to expand our ranks. We're looking for experienced professionals who know their way around ships, weapons and armor. If you'd like to join the APA, make good money and make a difference, send your resume to Apollo Protection Agency offices on Absalom Station to arrange a meeting with me, Titanium Mike Agamasan and you could become the newest member of the APA, where we put the pro in protection. <laughs> hey guys, this is Heath. I always wanted to do a commercial for the APA, uh, but this was also my not-so-subtle way of bringing up the Apollo Protection Agency tier of the Southern Time Foolery Patreon. For 10 bucks a month, you get all the benefits of the $2 and $5 tiers, as well as some neat buttons and, more excitingly, early access to the new episodes every week. So, while everyone else will get the episodes on Sunday as a loyalty agent of the APA, you'll get the new episodes on Fridays. You'll also receive access to a private Discord channel just for you APA early birds to chat away about the episode without having to worry about those who still have to wait. If you can swing it, we'd love the support, and you'll be putting us that much closer to achieving our Patreon goals, one of which is to do some spin-off adventures with fan favorite Weldy and his gang of friends. These would be GM'd by Emily, which means that for the first time, you guys would get to hear Adam as a player, subject to someone else's whims. Anyway, let's get the show on the road with episode 33, To Sell and Back. How y'all doing today? What? Starfinder Thursday! Yeah, Thursday. Starfinder Thursday. Or Sunday Thursday in the prison. People who are listening. Yeah, I was like, that's confusing. Uh, <laughs> These don't release on yeah, Thursday. It's Thursday yeah. for us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, it's Thursday right now. It's a day that ends in Y, This is our time, to, it's the time that we play. Yeah, that's true. They listen on Sunday, don't they? Oh, You're sorry, late. folks. <laughs> You're sorry, late, everyone. You're late, listeners. <laughs> <laughs> Um. All right. Well, how's everybody doing this evening? Uh, except for Zach, because I know he's not doing great. Not great. Not my not my best day. I'm here, but yeah, wisdom teeth removal. What? Mm. Why? Why? What's What's the problem? I had my man? wisdom teeth out, man. Okay. <laughs> had your wisdom teeth out. You know, you're a real you're a real trooper for being here. I appreciate it. Uh, the show must go on, and I also just really True. want to play some Starfinder. Yeah. Thank uh, you for your service, man. Mm-hmm. I hope everyone excuses oh, man, my, you're welcome. Uh, my voice or lack thereof. I don't know. It's very NPR. I dig it. I have NPR voice tonight. <laughs> 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 it's a growing crisis. Mm-hmm. The edges of Aslanti's grace. <laughs> we have some experts on tonight to discuss the issue. <laughs> Love you so much for that. Oh, oh man. man. Uh, well, y'all, we are we are getting into it. You guys are are closing in on the cells, but the prison guards are also closing in on you. I would say that it's probably fair. To say that the jig is up. Mm. 
at I don't this know. point. I think right? the plan is kind of 48 out of 55 right now, you know. A clean, that is clean. 48 that is out of 55. That's not how that term is supposed to be used. <laughs> I, no. I, I, I like it. I think that's it. apropos. That's, it's a clean. It's literally not. No, yeah, this, is like, it, this is like this is like a clean two out of fifty five right now. <laughs> yeah, no, <laughs> a solid okay, a- two. Adam, Adam, from a yes. GM's perspective, as on a scale from "Ooh, baby, you got it" to "Dear God, what have you done?" Like, where are we at right now? We already have a fifty five uh, point scale. Use that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I would say you're in. Oh shit, we fucked this up. So, seems- on that part of the scale. So, oh, closer cool, cool, cool. to the, oh God. 25 oh, God. out of 55? <laughs> I mean, 33? that's being generous. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's being generous. Out I, of think 55? It, I think, yeah, six, six, uh, uh, a not so clean 16 out of 55. <laughs> How about a sloppy Guys, I'm, 12? I'm not a messy 16. A messy like sloppy opinion, 12. Man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, oh, I'm of the mentality okay. like, we're not stuck in here with you, you know? You're stuck in here with us until we kill you. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. we'll see. Shall we? Sure. A little voice of confidence before we start this session. As oh, as I we are barricaded in a room away from everyone else. It's okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. We're gonna you're fight totally tomorrow. safe here. <laughs> we're going to be fine, um, guys. Everybody's going to be fine. <laughs> so at the at the end of last session, Mike was put on the table and kind of brought back to consciousness. Um, in the meantime, that took about a minute to do. Uh, Oren was and Zeno were kind of tending to him. Ziva and Fell, I think that during that minute, if you'd like, you could search this area since the doctor has vamped. Now, here's the thing about that. The doctor has vamped. And I think that this should be distressing news to you. Because he's probably going to let the whole rest of the moon know that you're here. So I must stress to you that you are on a tight, tight clock to get this done or else y'all are screwed. Uh, I mean, you don't have time to screw around anymore. So every action counts. Every minute counts. Every second counts. So in the spirit of, of that of setting you up with this terrible situation. I will start you off with while Mike is being healed during that minute, you guys can search during that minute since every second counts. Okay. We do that. So at the risk of sounding uh, really kind of lame, what the hell does vamped mean? Like I get the context, but like Uh, I've never heard that before. Like vamoosed? Yeah, it's Vanished. similar to that. There you go. Okay. There you go. Yeah, he vanished. Learned Learned something. Something. Uh, GTFO. You know how it goes, man. Come on. Uh, Skedaddle. So, <laughs> I do, I do want to go ahead. And... Uh, so, Zeno, you're, you're, you're helping with Mike. Yes, so I am. So, it's Ziva yeah. and... So, so let, me, let me handle them first. Um... You don't really need to roll a perception. This is an infirmary, thus everything is pretty clearly marked. Um, You open a few cabinets and you find throughout the room some Mark I serums of healing. Ten, to be exact. Yes, yes, yes. You you find four Mark II serums of healing. You find two doses of spray flesh and an assortment of 12 tier 1 medicinals split evenly between analgesics, antitoxins, and sedatives. Hmm. Okay. Cool. Um, dumb housekeeping question. Who wants to put that in inventory? I think everybody needs to um, hold a few of them at least. Everyone needs at least two or three. I have four on me. Yeah. I'm fixing to pop Jeez. one of them. All right, so we've got my. I'm so I'm gonna uh, you know once they start pocketing those, I'm gonna kind of stab my leg with a with one to try to get some HP back as well. Yeah, so we've got. All right, so ten. what we're gonna do is like 
one d eight heals. Hold Sorry. on. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna heal up to max HP, and we'll do that off air real quick, right? Okay. All right. So the whole party is healed up on HP. Unfortunately, there was nothing we could do for the stamina. Um, and yeah. fell. You took two Mark One and one Mark Two oh. to your inventory. I already had a Mark Two, so, but yeah. Shut up. Uh, Heath, <laughs> you you took the same, right? Yeah, two Mark Ones and one Mark Two. And then Zeno and Ziva, the Z Squad, each took one of each. Correct. I still uh, have three Mark Ones. I took a Mark Two, and I took all of the uh, um, analgesics and serums and toxins and stuff. The the medicinals, the medicinals as it right, were. Yeah. All right. As this is all happening, you hear on the door to the infirmary that you're in. Boom, 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 boom. I, I am come out. I immediately vomit. come out. <laughs> yeah, you, 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 you didn't stuff give up. me yeah. time. That's how I respond to, pick to up my goo blob. a door knock. I mean, yeah, the soldier doesn't give a shit about your time, but you can do that while he's pounding on the door. Just letting you know, this this Aeon guard is pounding on the door. Come out! It, it is futile. The entire moon knows of your presence here. Surrender, and we will make this easy for you. <laughs> I have no intentions of surrendering, folks. I, I lean off the bed and vomit yeah, think between, any of us between the feet of Zeno and Aaron. You guys like jump back as as Mike just leans over the side and, and hurls up uh, his little prison kit. So remind us, what's all in that kit? First, I want to say it's basically like a softball sized booger. Um, <laughs> Storage poo, right? That was have... drinking something. Ooh. Is it blue? I keep thinking that it's blue. For I've some always reason. imagined it as green, but I don't think it specifically says what color it is. I imagine it's like kind of a gray white. Well, it's not your item, is it? <laughs> Fair. No, it's not. It actually has glitter in it, so you can all get over it. So. Oh, that, that would be that would be painful. <laughs> that would a bunch be of glitter terrible. in your stomach. Yeah. Uh, no, oh god. The, the only glitter is in your shit sparkles for months. No, the only glitter in it is in my engineering kit, and that's just for special occasions. Uh, but it has a zip stick <laughs> and ion tape. Uh, you know, they go together. Why have one without the Ooh. other? Um, it's got right. a laser microphone in case you need to, you know, Ooh. hear through a thin door. Uh, and it's got an engineering kit, my personal engineering kit. Sweet. Cool. So, yeah, you have this guard pounding fiercely on the door, um, demanding you to lay down and give up and, and basically telling you that. Not only is the cell block on alert, but the entire prison moon. Well, that's what do you do? Worse. This is not good, Mike. Not good at all. Got your back, Ziva. We need the sword. That makes sense. Well, Michael, here you go. Do some work, and she hands over the. Uh, Inevitable Did she downfall. just summon it into her hand and then oh, hand it yeah. over? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> just whoop, 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 whoop. Uh, yeah. And uh, while I, she's I, at it... I don't want to leave that out, you know? No, no, no. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Come on. It's a shard blade. <laughs> it's a shard blade, right. And as soon as yeah. she relinquishes that blade to Mike, she's going to pull out her um, azimuth later laser pistol and say... Zeno, hopefully you can do a little bit more damage with this and kind of winks at him and hands that over because I don't think we ever actually got you that gun. No, the uh, the pulse caster pistol. Yeah. Yes. So that deals non-lethal damage for what it's worth, yeah. but you at least have a weapon. Yeah. And now Mike is armed with inevitable downfall. Uh, would you guys like to, like, you know, try to get him out of his cuffs? Yeah, that'd be great. Mm. Oh, yeah. Nah, man. yeah. Oh, shit. What do, you, what do you have <laughs> yeah. to do for that? You're welcome. We have You're the welcome. keys to the cuffs, right? No, but you have a pretty good mechanic that could probably get it get it open. Uh, is it why, why, why isn't anybody taking those things off you yet? <laughs> he just uh, looks uh, really you, good recall, in manacles. If you recall, this ain't no time for jokes, right? If you recall, I've been unconscious for some time. <laughs> Uh, so that's why I didn't yeah, take I mean, so is it. 
I thought, is I thought one of you guys would have. Okay. Yes. Yeah, All right. 24. So, so Fel is able to get in there and um, with his little kit, with his little tools that he carries around, uh, he's able to undo the locks. I mean, for what it's worth, you guys put the locks on. So you have a pretty easy pick on this. Um, Mike, how does it feel to have your fist, your claws, back in action now with a sword in your hand? How do you feel? Uh, I mean, he's pretty pissed off, my guy. I mean, yeah. I know you're setting up some triumph there, but no, nah, he's just mad. Like, because he <laughs> allowed himself to be tased for a minute and a half until he was unconscious so that we could not get in a fight and now we're in a fight but it is good to have a sword well i want my power gauntlet though like really badly yeah well i think the fans want i summoned, got a sword. I summoned my power i want gauntlet. your power gauntlet Sorry, <laughs> I summon. <laughs> Let me know oh, how I'm that goes. Speaking, speaking of summoning, I forgot the last item that's in my uh, belly booger. What's that? Uh, it's a fucking summoning grenade. <laughs> so that's great. right. Okay, yeah, okay. The Pokeball. All right. Belly booger. No. Oh, the it's Poke a Pokeball. Ball. Oh, my God. Okay. It's yeah. basically a Pokeball. The knocking suddenly stops. Maybe they left. Sorry, guys, he's going stuff. away. Guys, I think, I think we might need to take cover. And Fell's going to move off to the side yeah, of the door. Let's all, let's all, let's all roll initiative. How about that? <laughs> oh, okay. He's trying to get the jump on it. As Eva runs away, the foe first. <laughs> please, please. Hey, a 19. That's not bad. Initiative. Right. Sino and Orin tying with a five. Yeah. Ugh. Oh, we both got point oh three. Yeah, five point oh three. I know. Zeno and Orin. Who's got you the higher first? Deck? You want me to go first? Uh, uh, all right. Deck. You know so, what? For sure. I'll go first. Well, you know who's going to go first is not the any Aeon, of the you. Aeon guard with the twenty-four. <laughs> so here's the. Well, that's yeah. Great. So. Here's the turn order. Fel's got a 19, Ziva's got a 13, Mike's got an 11, and Zeno and Orin are tied at a 5. The Aeon Guard is going to do something that you're not aware of, because there's a closed door between you. Fel, what would you like to do? Uh, I'm going to ready an action for if the door is opened. I'm going to shoot him. And that's I mean. It. You know that the door can't be opened because you have hold portal on the door currently. True. No, no, not hold portal. No, no, no. It, it was it was welded near. shut by. Oh no, you it jammed, jammed it. Yeah, yes. you jammed it. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Can you unjam it with the same like a hacking check? Does Chutney remove jam? Hey. I think so. <laughs> Beep. <laughs> I mean, I could probably go up and do an engineering check, but uh, you know, the whole six seconds and all. Um, shit, I don't know. Like, I, I, uh, hold my turn. I don't have anything I can do right now, really. Okay, Ziva. Uh, Ziva is knowing that that door is locked is going to aim at the external door because there is a door to the moon correct to the north is that accurate am i correct, correct. okay and that yeah, is the only airlock. other oh shit. portal in this room correct oh uh, that is okay, such a yeah, dreadful so thought so she's gonna aim her pistol there and say out loud if he can't get through that door he may be trying to go around to the outside uh, any ideas, gentlemen? Mike, you're up. Um, I mean, uh, he's still a little out of it, so he's just kind of readying his sword for whichever way we need to go. Like, he's not in any position to tell you where we need to go right now. He woke up in this room. I think we need to storm him. I mean, just I can break fly. down the door. I can try or or, or un, unjam we it. Just, we need to, we need to go take the fight to him. Um, 
So I guess we'll just cycle back around then. Well, huh? you're actually, just gonna hold, or I, Zeno, you can give a shot. Okay, so uh, just a couple of questions. First off, the stairwell that is uh, that rounds this room that leads up to what looks like a second floor. Is there anything that we can take point just in case that we are stormed in here? Uh, second off, uh, perception rolls. Is there anything like maybe duct work or anything? That, I'm thinking of possibilities. I mean, so the above floors are like, those are all like servers and storage closets up there at the top. Um, as far as perception, go ahead and roll a perception. Okay. All right. Doing perception now. Okay. I rolled a 19. You hear some sounds of like banging or like prying coming from the main cell block hub. Banging and prying from the main cell block hub. Okay, yep. I'll go ahead and just uh, pass that word on to the rest of the crew. Can I Let's take my turn? Let's fucking go. Let's go, everyone. Okay. Orin is extremely impatient. Why, did, why is the door not already open? All right, we're going to cycle I'm back around. I'm directly behind right? Mike. Whenever Mike's no, Adam, moving, Adam, I'm Adam, directly behind Mike. Fail's got to open the door, guys. Yeah. I think yeah, we're gonna Adam, just going to cluster around a little bit. Well, I am a little bit right here. I was uh, holding my turn. Can I not take it before the I know. Ends? I got you, brother. Do your thing. Okay. You're saying First, hey, hey, guys. I know you're around. stressed in this prison situation. We're, we're all bit. extremely stressed. Every- I, need, I need everybody to remember we're playing a game. <laughs> I am trying to kill you, but don't take it out on me. <laughs> <laughs> Cool. What do I need to do to open this damn door? <laughs> you tell me what you want to try to do. I want to undo the jamming that Zeno did to it. All right. Roll an engineering check. Okay. As a 25. Uh, 25 is good, though, to, to do it. So before round two, you get the door open. It's now round two. All right. And that's it for Val. Word. Well, I'm going to open the door, and what do I see? Uh, You see what you saw before. The cell block hub, and you do not see the Aeon Guard in front of you. Hey, guys, this, uh, this next room's clear. Let's go. But you definitely hear the sounds of of some sort of, like, prying or, like, banging on somewhere coming from within the room. Uh, All right, so uh, Fell's going to move move in as far as he can with his heavy armor, and that's his turn. Okay, Ziva. Uh, Ziva is going to double move so that she can if, well, follow. You can actually move three three times your speed, right? Or is it four times your speed that you can move? Yeah, it's four times your speed if you take a whole um, turn. Okay, let me... Right? I'm basically going to come up right on the other side of... Um, or, excuse me, I'm sorry, right behind Fell, just so that I'm kind of covering right his Right behind back. Fell. So okay. that's, that's her. Okay. Mike, you're up. So everybody's kind of flooding out of the infirmary back into the cell block hub. Now you still see the three dead Aeon guards that you took care of, but you've yet to see this Aeon guard that was just moments ago banging on the door. Again, you hear this clatter and this din. Zeno, uh, Mike, what are you doing? Uh, I turn to Zeno and Aron real quick, give them the, the tactical eyes. Like, w- watch my back. I'm not at my best. And uh, I have 40 feet of movement speed, so I'm going to run past Ziva and Fell. Okay. But it's like just right, like one square in front of, you know, five feet in front of Phil. Okay. When you do that, you actually can see the guard is trying to unjam the door to the south. Tight. I mean, like, if if as a free action I can turn to the people directly behind me who can't see him, I'm going to, you know, be like, shh, like put my finger to my lips, like... If he doesn't notice us yet. Oh, uh, well, if you want to do this stealthily, I need you to roll a stealth check, please. Well, 
I'm sure that won't go well, but we can try it. Thirteen. Yeah, he turns on you, says, they're here! Zeno, you're up. Zeno is going to go ahead and proceed out the doorway, uh, just moving the allowed uh, space that he can. That's going to be right there. Too. So that puts you pretty much right behind Ziva. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, well, hold on. There we go. I got a little weird pop up. There we go. Yeah, right behind um, uh, Ziva. Kind of filing in line as we All go right. through this hallway. Awesome. So yeah, you've got right now coming out of the infirmary, you've got Mike in front, then Fell, then Ziva, then Zeno. If you remember the layout of this, the central hub has like an X shape of hallways coming out of it and then coming directly on the south cardinal direction is the hallway that you took to get to this cell area. The Aeon Guard is trying desperately to get the door open so that the security robots can come through. Oren, you're up. Okay, so I am going to... I'm going to use Jet Dash, and I'm just going to fly past all, all of the party and go all the way around to the back <laughs> and hop over the center console and take cover behind mm -hmm. the center console and as part of move action, draw my, my rifle and take cover behind the center console. All right, so... That is ridiculous. So... Uh, yeah, so yeah. you guys see, you guys see Orin just like a blur past you. you, you all your hair or your clothes just ripple with wind as he. I feel like it's got to be like kind know, of cosmic but, ripples, right? You know what I mean? Yeah, just <laughs> in like you don't even like really see him, right. and then all of a sudden he's like popped up in the center console, has his rifle resting on on the desk, and he's got cover behind behind the desk. Now, was that your action to move that far? Yeah, that's my whole turn. That's turn. your whole turn. Okay. Yeah. It's not. I, I, the I can Aeon go guard. a lot further, but I'm just, you know. That's, that's right, all right. I needed I was the 80 action. feet. That, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 74, 74 and a half feet. No big deal. I mean, y you can move four times your movement speed if you use a full round he, action he, to run. He gets there in right. time to like eat a sandwich, but he makes sure you know that it's like a cosmic sandwich. It's, it's like that sandwich. Quicksilver <laughs> moment, you know, sandwich. in that uh, one of those X-Men movies. I think it was, I can't remember which one it was. But yeah, Quicksilver. Yeah. Good story, bro. Yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> so <Is it> <laughs> uh, <laughs> So the AI guard's going to stop working with the door now that he sees that you're in here. And he's going to step forward one spot, about five feet up. And he is going to... I guess shoot Mike with the assault rifle. Natural 20. Great. Fucking Come on. Oh roll, to confirm. Uh, roll to confirm. Right, me, roll, roll to confirm. Because he is named Toriver is his name. Concealment. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying. I rolled a natural 20 on the confirm. Man. No. Well, get the just, fuck out just, of here, man. Just get out. Let's, that let's the card, broken. dude. That die's broken. Oh let's get God. the card, John. Don't, we're not, this don't, is don't, a bad yeah, start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So, critical hit, and that was a kinetic, correct? Just confirming. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. That is disarming shot. Crit effect. Attempt a free disarm combat maneuver against the target at the same attack bonus, regardless of range. Okay. Oh my god. That's, that's so not that bad. It's, it's normal damage. It's normal damage. So that's good. So it's going to be 11 damage. Aye. Uh, and then uh, disarm. That's against CMD, right? I actually. Yeah, CMD plus. K A eight. targets right. yeah, CAC that's, plus. That's eight. actually CAC plus A. Right. And I'm assuming a success just. So. Disarm. Disarms make, and if you them. have a free hand, you can automatically grab the item before it falls. Okay, I'm not close enough to grab it, but I rolled a 19 on the die, so that's going to be enough to make you 
she, he, he shoots inevitable downfall out of your hand. Damn. Okay. Well, this plan's gone to shit. Damn. <sighs> okay. Fell, you're up. Yikes, stripes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is, uh... Oh, my gosh. This is, oh. this is not so great. Uh, Fell's going to move half of his movement into the room so that he can see what he sees. And, oh, he's right up in his grill. Neat. Um... And is going to uh, shoot him with a laser rifle. Uh, you guys. All right, here we go. Oh, critical hit. Nat 20. Nice. Nat <laughs> Come on, y'all. Right. Get excited. 20. That's huge. Right. We spot a critical I, with I a critical really man. I just I, I try not to yell. That's, I know you no can't yell. Yeah, up, I know. But no, yeah, I just I'm got super like, a wave all of, of relief yeah. now. Get Let's see if, Let's see if it confirms. See if it confirms. See if it confirms. Oh, oh my God. No. No. Oh, six. It just came through. All right, well, okay. it still hits. It's You're still going to do 21 damage. Ooh, You're not going to get the burn effect on burn, it, though. Baby. Um, but you do do 21 God, damage with that crit. That'll oh. do, man, man. That, That's... That... That is... So wait, are, pretty are we, solid hit. Ever the, ever the rules lawyer... Even at my own detriment, are we like? Does is that still like two damage rolls, or is yes, it just it, the no it is. card, or what? No, it is because what the crit cards do. That's significant. You choose whether or not to use the critical effect that's associated with the weapon, right? Right, which is the burn effect, mm -hmm. or use the crit card. Okay. So that's what it replaces. Now it's different than when we play our five E games. This is replacing the extra critical effect. You still get the extra damage. Sure, but if I don't confirm, do I still get that extra damage? Yes, because it's still a critical hit. Okay, you cool. You just don't get the card. Cool. Okay. Because there's uh, there's technically no confirmations in Starfinder. Okay. But since we're using crit decks, we're using a confirmation system to draw the card because they're stronger effects. Okay. Gotcha. You know, I all thought right, we were doing it for all, all crits. Okay, cool, 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 cool. That's awesome. Uh, we'll take it. <laughs> Don't look. Gift horse, yeah. Josh. Yeah. Gift horse, my man. <laughs> hey, look, man. I'm just trying to be fair. Okay. Ziva, you are up. That was a great turn, yeah. Josh. So Ziva Last is going to say... Right fucking face. <laughs> Ziva's going to take a step up so she can see um, the situation. Can she tell quickly what kind of weapon <laughs> the AG's got? Uh, assault rifle. Okay. She's gonna. Uh, you know what? What? Fell, you're gonna get an opportunity attack on you. Does he have a melee weapon equipped? In oh, his hands? fair, fair, Boom. fair, fair, okay. fair. Boom shakalaka. All right. All right. She's gonna continue her movement and come up just past Mike and take a shot uh, on the the gentleman with the, the boom boom stick. Uh, with no, don't shoot me. Okay, now he's gonna get a little bit of cover here Let's as you're shooting through, through some. Yeah, it's, still, it's pretty much all you got, try. you know. And deep breath. Oh, no, I pushed the wrong button. <laughs> <laughs> Keep holding your breath. <laughs> Don't breathe. Oh, no. No, an eight's probably not going to get it. Uh, yeah, it's not going to get it. No. Fucking A. Yeah. Okay, so Ziva... Not used to shooting guns, apparently, yeah. after having a sword for so long. Mrs. Mike. <clears throat> I mean, the, so the sword is on the ground next to me? Or did he fling it across All right, the so room? you're going to have to use your move action to pick it up. No, it's just knocked out of your hand. The problem is, is you have to use a move action to pick it up, it's which means you won't be able to action. get... Drawing is part of a move action. Oh, right? Okay, I don't right. think picking it up yeah. off the ground. Oh, man. I almost... Cool. But I didn't. You're still... I mean, you're within five feet, though, technically. Not, well, not really. But but what it can do is take a five-foot step, a guarded step, pick up the thing, and then swing. A, because he's only five feet away. Because you can guard it. I just uh, always yeah. think of guarded steps as, like, moving away from... Like, we've done this once before where it's like, oh, you move to him with the guarded step? Yeah, I'll do that. I mean, it's not really the intended purpose of it, but it works here. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Um, and then I can hit him. Right? 
But yeah, yeah neat. you can try. Um, yep, I'm just going to have to roll a d20 and add my mod. Oh, five. Great. What's your mod? Plus eight. Plus eight, so that's a 13? Yes. Total? Yeah, that's not, that's not going to get yeah, her. I didn't think it would. Okay, Zeno, you're up. All right, John, you're up. Zeno's up. What you going to do? All right. So, Zeno is going to proceed forward, and he's going to get next to all of his other crewmates. <laughs> okay. And he... Okay, so there's the Aeon Guard. Okay, so, yeah, regular attack, standard attack, because I moved. One pulse caster pistol, and that's going to be uh, again uh, cover. So that is going to be. Just tell me what you rolled. I rolled a fifteen. I'll manage the cover. All right, that is not going to get it. Okay, that's a miss. All right. All right, Oren, you're up. I think. Now you've got a shot. You've got a clean shot on it. I think a full attack is what I need to do here. Going just full from, attack. Just, just lift the rifle out from cover and just bam, bam. You know. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna full attack. Okay, first attack. What'd you roll? A 19. That's gonna hit. For three piercing damage. For, for three damage. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. And your second attack. Eight misses. Ooh, that's not gonna. Yeah, hit. yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, well. That was, that was rough. It's All now right. the Aeon Guard's turn. Toriver. And I guess he is going to punch Mike with a Thunder Strike Pulse Gauntlet. Oh man, no. he's got a gauntlet. Like this but is also kill him injury. so you can have his. But rookies. also, uh, he misses. Cool, right? Ten, ten misses. Yeah, yeah. but not he, not by much. Because I'm naked. <laughs> right. Well, you're not armored. That's why I had to ask. Um. And then the second one, critical fail. Good. Yes. You gotta confirm oh, it there, no. right? Yeah. Okay, that's a 21, so it doesn't confirm the fail, but misses nonetheless. Okay. Just tries to punch, and your boxing days, you're bobbing and weaving as he misses you. Like, like doesn't he doesn't realize who he's going up against. He doesn't realize he's going up against a pro boxer here, <laughs> and just whiffs. All right, fell, you're up. Uh, Fell is going to take a guarded step back and shoot with, uh, uh, what's it called? With overcharge. So they'll do okay. another extra 1d6, an extra 1d6 if I hit. So let's do that. Oh, Are another you? crit! Oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> Fucking kidding yeah. me, dude! <laughs> Oh Serious? man, oh, I'm gonna go, go ahead and roll that extra 1d6 damage. Beautiful. Praise R in Jesus. Oh, and right, a 6 on that. <laughs> wow. I have one. Oh, right, roll to confirm. And Take you know what? I'm gonna fan. roll to confirm. Um, if I choose not to confirm it, or we always confirm it, right? And if I confirm, I get either the burn damage or a card? Correct. Okay, so let's uh, let's roll to confirm. 22 against EAC. Yeah, that's going to confirm. That's confirmed. Oh, yeah. with Let's get the card, that, man. Let's get the card, John. No, you, he, you think? Oh, yeah. Wait. You get to okay. choose, right? He gets to choose, right? It's, well, it's he more... can listen to the choice. The, he can oh, okay. listen to the card and then choose. Cool. All right. So, critical hit. Uh, that's going to be with uh, kinetic, correct? Correct. All right. Uh, no, it's energy. Okay. Yeah. So, energy. Stunning hit. Crit effect. The target is stunned for one round. Fortitude negates. All right, and so what is the DC? Mm -hmm. It's the confirmed roll, right? I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Like the DC is going to be a DC 22 yes. fortitude. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to take my luck with that card. Uh, okay, fails the fortitude. 
Sweet. Nice. So he's stunned for a round. We're, we're doing a total of 17 plus 6 is 23 damage. Is that it doesn't matter because you did enough damage to kill him with the shot. Yeah. Good. So wow. Torver falls. Damn, good job. However, you can see the like robot. You can't see the robot, but you can see the door being just being banged against as this robot is trying to get through. What do you do? Uh, Mike, tape it up. Yes. Guys, armor up. Well, Mike, armor up and somebody else tape it. Here, give me the tape. I'll tape it. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. yeah. That's why I toss yeah, you the, I'll the take zip. That. The tape we literally. The Let's keep it moving. We start duct taking the door. Well, I need, to, I need to equip some armor as well. Yeah, we'll help Mike and. Um, and Zeno strip this armor off and get armored as fast as possible. I know that cool, there's cool. probably rules for donning and doffing in Starfinder. I haven't looked into them, but uh, whatever we can do to help get that. I think it takes a minute to put on heavy armor. By, like, by yourself, but like, what if I have armor bitches? Can we cut the time down? <laughs> <laughs> They're called squires, okay? Excuse me, it's a respectable title. <laughs> So donning armor. Go and get the breastplate stretch out. <laughs> so heavy armor requires 16 rounds to don or remove. So that'd be a minute and basically a minute and a half to. You can don hastily in half the normal time to a minimum of one full action. The armor check penalty, maximum dexterity bonus, and armor bonus for hastily donned armor are one worse than normal. So, so while Mike is doing that, then we have we can do, be doing some things. We yes. have time. Correct. Yes. All right. Correct. We need to storm this door. Um, I want to I want to pound this X-ray potion really fast so that I can look through the door up there and see we'll see what's in there. I have an X-ray potion. This bitch got an X-ray. Which X-ray, door? An X-ray, X-ray serum. Potion? Yeah, it's an X-ray serum. Okay. I have um, three of them actually. So, you which door are you looking through? Uh, the one into the into the prisoners, the north west door. All right. While Ziv is taping up the the south door, you know. Okay, so Oren, you do the X-ray vision. Yeah. What do I see? You see a hallway that continues past the door and then pitches a little bit to the north. And you can't really see much else because there's walls, but you see that there's like. A couple gated doors. Like cells? That, well, no, not cells, like security doors, right? Okay. But they don't they don't seem to have any like computer security things. They're just gates. Like straight old fashioned, like barred gate doors. Oh, shit. And I will tell you at this point now, two minutes have passed. We gotta go. Shit. Has, fell, has, fell. has Ziva got the, the the stuff taped up? Yet? I mean, since since you since you walked out of the, or since we started the session, it's oh, been okay. two minutes. Have, oh, okay. Has Ziva taped the stuff up? Yes, she's st- in that in that minute yeah. that it took took Mike to kind of get his armor on. Zeno, you need some armor too, right? That's correct. <laughs> All right, so you, I think. So you you can basically re-equip your second skin because that's what they have. Mm-hmm. Nice. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and add that. How does that? But feel, time baby? is ticking. Yeah. So yeah. What's Phil doing while this is going on? So this while can all be happening. Yeah, while they're donning their armor and stuff, Fel's going to make his way into the center consoles or that circular structure and check out the computers, see what he can do with them, if something's logged in, what they control, you know, the usual. Um, there is just basic, like, data entry here. There's a list of all the prisoners. That'd be good. Can I do a control F on that? <laughs> yeah. So, there are five prisoners in the prison cells. There is a Sheeran, a like crab-like creature, a Ikeshti. Am I saying that right? Ikeshti. Ikeshti. Oh. Which is just yeah, a lizard. Yeah, That's all. There. Kesha. Uh, yeah, and there is a Vesk. And then there is a 
like something that it says species unknown but there's like a picture of it and it's a giant huge worm like oh, caterpillar like wow. creature oh. um, and then there is only one occupant of the slave cells That's and convenient. it's marked as classified what wonder the F? That I mean, I, we know who it is. Let's, let's, like, mm -hmm. Are they are they still locked? Is what you're saying? Like all the doors are, cell doors are shut and locked. Uh, yeah, yeah. This is just a, okay. like a list of a roster of yeah. who's in the prison. So, so, Can you do uh, any hacking? Uh, what? Go ahead, Heath. I was gonna say upon like uh, assessing the cell situation, like he'd turn to you know as he always does. Hey, uh, IT squad, like, let's get these doors open. And you know, spread out. Tell them what the situation is. I'm, I'll take the vest. Okay. Or, or don't. I mean, like. All right. What you think, Captain? I just. So we're in a hurry. Fell, is that everything? Anything else you can uh, glean from this situation before we barge in? Do those logs have names, or is it just the species? Uh, yeah, it has names. Okay. I want to search for Mothkala, Sikchi, and Silvara. But we weren't getting Well, they're name. clearly on the list. Okay. Yep. Well, I want to know what cells they're in. It's three out of five, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. Uh, so, Seek Cheek is in cell one. Mathkala is in cell two. And what was the third one? Uh, the one that she could was It was a Silvara, but it wasn't given a name. Right. Uh, yes, that is in cell two. With so the vest or with Mathkala? Seek Cheek is in cell one. The Silvara is in cell two. Vertosh, the lizard folk, is in cell three. Mothkala is in cell four. Cell five is unoccupied. And Grub is the only name given for the <laughs> caterpillar. <laughs> I like it. In cell six. Cool. Have a new cool, best cool, cool, cool. So, Fel's going to relay that. Look, guys, all the, the, the people that Talmarin said that we need to get are here. Uh, and some classified something other than the uh, the android wing I mean who do you think that could be surely <laughs> I wonder <laughs> as the southern door continues to yeah, get smashed open, on open the damn door right, but we gotta go right, a marching order gentlemen and Ziva's gonna step up behind Orin towards the um, cell block door yeah I step up next to Ziva didn't you say that there was a, an assault rifle in here, I mean, yeah, the the Aeon guard had an assault rifle. I want to go ahead and grab that. All right, drag an AG assault rifle. Thank you. And I'm gonna get like uh, a second to last in the group. All right, open it up. All right, so you guys just collected some gear. We got both. Zeno and Mike armored up and weaponed up. Oren did a little x-ray through the door. Fell got a roster of who's in there. There's a couple extra prisoners that you weren't anticipating. Plus the three that Talmarin wanted you to find. What do you do? Uh, before we make any... Bust that fucking door. Bold, hold on. Before that, before that specific thing. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I want to quickly <laughs> use uh, one of my Mark One serums because I did take like eleven damage. I'm just gonna quickly right, so inject it into my neck because I'm hardcore. All right, go ahead and roll that D8. Get that sweet juice. Oh, nice! Ah, nice. The, the juice. Y'all are rolling rocks tonight. Rolling rocks. All right, so everybody get in marching order before we I will open be the door. Second line. I think probably Mike and Phil up front. Huh? Yep. Our big armor. I'll be four. Right. Mike fell for the breach. Oop, oop, Siva. Well, I mean, uh, just behind it's Mike. Strategically, like it's it, it's dope. Fell's got armor now, but like there's not as much impetus on you to like force yourself into the role of tanking now that I can effectively do it again. Just saying, don't get yourself killed. Try I to think still got high AC. I was just saying, at this point, we're looking at AC for blockers. <laughs> I mean, I, I hear... Well, also, I, meat shields, I understand so that. Fel's got stamina. Yeah. 
All right. Well, well Charles got to be up front anyway to try to open the door, right? So yep. let me get that engineering check. Will do. And would anybody like to? Well, never mind. Too late. I would, yeah, I, I would got have twenty six. <laughs> Sorry, right, I'm a little bit so quick on that trigger. Twenty six. Twenty six is good enough though, and the door opens into the into the prison cells as the door slides open. <laughs> You see this hallway in front of you. Let's move in as far as... You ready? You guys go? Yeah, we got I'll move you guys as a group just to make it easy. All right. Everybody roll initiative. All right. You betcha. As you walk in, six transparent cylinders line the northern and southwestern arcs of this dome, their exteriors humming with some mystical force. A raised, windowed room to the east looks out over the rest of the chamber, and a lone door exits to the southeast. That's the one that you just came through. So the room to your right, Ziva and Mike, is like a control room that overlooks the entire cell. You see three guards in here, one in the control room, and one on the north side of the cell block, and one on the south side. Everybody rolled initiative, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yes. you want to know what yes. they are? All right, yeah, let's list them off. What do y'all got? One by one, let's start with Josh. Got a seven. Seven, that's not great. No, it's not. Okay, uh, what about you, Zach? Twenty. Twenty. Okay, how about Strength you, cool. Mike? I got a ten. I took that feat, a but ten. it doesn't seem to have done me very much good. <laughs> All right. What about you, Ziva? Ziva rolled a 21. Okay, very good. And finally, what about you, Zeno? Zeno rolled a 13. Heard. (laughs) Well, Ziva, you got the jump. Now, you can't hit the person in the control room. There's like a solid glass, you know, pane in between, you know, blocking you from being able to get a shot through. Uh, but you can get a shot at the northern one. You'll have to move or whatever. But what would you like to do? So she is going to go ahead and move north um, past Mike to get a shot on the northern guy. And while she's going, she's going to try and look and see. Can I- Diomitis is his name. Diomitis? It's Diomitis. Wow. Yep. Call him Dio. Is that, is he I'll a call him a dick. Person um, or is this just the goof that we do? <laughs> no, this is named named okay. person. Um, and as she's moving forward, though, she's trying to check out and see where's the door to this eastern looky out uh, room. So yeah, you step up and you can see a door right there to your right. Okay. Um, so yeah, she's going to take a shot, take a shot, take a shot, 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 and okay. With her tactical semi-auto pistol, let's see. <sighs> 12 12 and that's what is that KAC KAC mm, that's a miss well that's stupid um but uh, yeah she's gonna stand right there because she's moved and she's made her action but now she knows where the door is so alright Oren you're up Oren as you step through the door all of a sudden <laughs> This like sonic energy starts pulsing through the room. I need you to roll a fortitude save. Okay. Who? Eleven. Probably not gonna get it. That is a failed save. You are sickened for one round as the sonic pulse just kind of makes you know scrambles your brain a little bit, makes you feel n- nauseous almost. Okay, well um, I'm gonna move. If I if I move up to the north part of the room there's like a half wall where the cells are does that give me cover from the guard mm-hmm. over here on the um northeastern corner of the room so i'm going to just take cover and i'm going to use one of my medicinals then to remove uh sickness this is a sonic debilitator effect so this is just like sound waves that are like causing you to be just as an aside, all of these medicinals are straight trash. These are garbage, junk items <laughs> that that really yeah. like, like what? Why are we? Why are, why are these even in the game? That's what, why not, the doctor not doing left anything them. for me. Yeah. What is this trash? 
I mean, I don't know what to tell you. It's an infirmary. They're gonna have I've, these I've things. You can take them what you any want. Any of these things. Okay. All right, that's fine. What What does that actually do? Does a minus two penalty to attack rolls, weapon damage rolls, saving throws, skill checks, and ability checks. Yeah. Minus two to everything. Everything. Minus two to everything. Hey, yeah. But look, yeah, it's uh, not great. I know you're sour yeah, about it. Yeah, I'll try to shoot the guard. I guess, man. I'll try to shoot the guard with my second. Uh, you know, just woozy. Take a shot. That's still an 18. That's not bad. It sure is. That's a good roll. That's yep. a hit. For five damage, even Can't, with the nice. second. Can't get my boy wow. down. Olenia, the one in the office, is going to move and try to take some cover behind the desk. It is Diamidas' turn. It's going to take a step up and shoot at Xena. Ziva, sorry. Xena, warrior princess? Warrior there we princess. go. We'll be on episode 50 and still get that wrong. And we're still going to get it wrong. Yeah. Well, hopefully I can just take her out right here. Bitch. You bitch. Okay, does a 14 hit? My. Okay. It's going to be EAC. 14 hits my EAC. Okay. I prefer it's you didn't. It's going to deal five damage. Well, all right. Zeno, you're up. All right, so Zeno is going to move forward. And I suppose that where I'm located, there is not a solid... Well, I can move past people, so I'm going to actually move... No, you move. have to move. You have to move, yeah. Okay, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and move Zeno past Mike Felino and... So as you move past Mike Felino and Ziva... I need you to roll a fortitude save. All right. I was anticipating that, so. Fortitude save. Coming in. At a hot You're 20. You're fine. You're good. Okay. And with that, You're, you're good. I want to go ahead and fire at this guy right here. At, at Dio? Yes. Okay. And I'm gonna fire my assault rifle AG. It's minus at a seven. That's a critical fail, actually. So okay, you need to well, roll. Let me go confirm. ahead and confirm that. Yeah. Roll just a regular D20. Uh, no, you yeah. just roll no, the attack. Roll another attack. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, doing it again. Eleven. <laughs> and that's against EAC. That is an assault rifle. I think that's KAC. That is a yeah, miss. Piercing. That is a critical fumble. Draw the card. Ah, all right. Okay, so critical fumble. It's kinetic, piercing. So pinprick. You gain the bleeding condition. One damage. Like he he like cuts himself on his gun. Oh wow. So like maybe I'm running past somebody and I cut myself yeah you, you know, cut yourself I'm, on the sword on, on right yeah on yeah yeah because yeah, yeah, yeah. they're yeah. not holding it at a say you know they're, not, they're holding it sideways like uh, some no, like that's not that's not cook. how i would do that you <laughs> cut yourself on one of mike's fucking horns that's how we're gonna do that because i would there never hold okay. sword. Okay. all right um, there we go there we go yeah yeah so the good thing is Ouch. that bleed tick <laughs> bleed ticks on the top of your turn so that won't start till yes. next turn yes okay. it's one damage okay all right, Mike. Was that, does that go towards HP or does that go towards uh, stamina? Starts, starts with stamina and then goes into okay, HP. Okay, thank right, you. So, Mike, you're right. up. Okay, <clears throat> so Mike uh, is standing. He starts his turn standing behind uh, Ziva and says, uh, Captain, you want me to take the one to the left or go north? Is there? Chop, chop. Go north. Yeah, I do that. Go north. Go, go north, Jon Snow. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, I've got 40 feet of movement speed. There's, I'm going to go north. All right, roll a fortitude, please. I roll my plus nine fortitude. Don't fail me now. 19. Black, black. You're good. I thought I might be. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I mean, Mike just, like, with purpose, walks up to, what's his, is this Dio or the, or the other one? Dio. Dio. Walks up to Dio, sword in one hand, inevitable downfall that is. And as he does, he like cocks his fist, you know, and uh, the in my head cannon, the gauntlet like covers his fist, his new gauntlet. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna punch him. 
21. 21 is going to hit for 12 bludgeoning damage. You knock him down to the ground. Yay, yay. Oh, oh, boy. Nice. Yeah. Okay, that's one down. Oh, Two that to go. feels so good. Paviata, she is going to run up and come through this door and strike at Fel from behind. Neat. All right, it's going to use a tack lash on you. Okay, so that's kinetic. It is kinetic. Uh, 13's going to miss, correct? That's a big miss. Yeah, <laughs> miss. Fel, you're up. All right, Fell is going to uh, turn around, take a guarded step back, and take a shot with his laser rifle. Okay. Oh, I need you to roll a fortitude save first. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Maybe not cool. Nope. Not you cool. are sickened. Oh, great. Great. Still shooting. But that's not great. I a crit fail. Oh, oh no. Right. Mm. Roll to confirm. Damn, it's like all highs and lows today. Come on. 16 against EAC. That is not a confirmed fumble. Sweet, so I just miss. Okay. Uh, Ziva, I need you to roll a fortitude save, please. Well, okay. Um... <laughs> Oh no, a three. <laughs> you are also sickened. Well, can I oh, figure- precious. All right, this is dumb. We gotta stop whatever this is. It doesn't fucking matter. Oh, I mean, we're all already sick, I guess. No, it we really are matter. not all already sickened. No, we are well, not. Can I tell- Ziva, what you gonna do? You're sickened. Can I tell what is making us sick? You can roll a perception check. I'm gonna roll that. Oh no, it's a 15. This pulsing s sonic sound is just it's just messing you up. You can't. Your eyes are watering. You can't see straight. You cannot find where it's coming from. Well, she's going to try... Got too much reverb. Yeah, she's going to try and access the door. She, like, maybe she can get out of this space. It'll stop. So she's going to try and get in the little room with the, the scaredy okay. bitch. Um, okay. Okay. Um, security squire. That open the door. It opens. Yep. I roll up with in your there. Aslanti finger. I, I would like to roll up in there, anyways. Yeah, you do. Um, there we go. And was the perception my action? No. Oh, sweet ball. Um, all right. So she steps in and she sees this other guy, this other Aslanti guard, and is going to take a shot with her. Okay. Seventeen to hit. Seventeen will hit for six piercing damage. Well, you still hit for six. Six. Okay. All right, Oren, fortitude save for me, buddy. Okay. If I pass the save, I lose sickened. Or I just sick roll sickened the goes roll, away. Just, just roll the fucking dice. Time. Roll the fucking right, die. Man, I'm just trying to roll the fucking some questions. Die. These are harmless questions, dude. Like, yeah, you're still sick, fucking bro. Fucking five. Fucking five. All right, perception check. I want to see if I can see where the sonic disruptor thing is coming from. Definitely okay. gonna do that. Definitely gonna do that. Where are you, perception? 21. Okay. All right. You can see that it's coming from this top of the room. Mm -hmm. That there's like this little like disc at the top of the room and you can kind of use your cosmic vision. You see waves just pulsing from this like little satellite, but like inverted satellite at the top of the room. Can I shoot it? Yes, you can. I'm going to shoot it. Nice. Have I have I used a movement action? Can I full attack it? No. Nope. I mean, yeah. You... I don't know if I need to. I've got negative two to everything. Yeah, that'd be like a then negative six to shouldn't. both. Yeah. Can't okay. imagine it's got much HP. All right, I'm just gonna shoot it the one time then. Twenty-three. 
Okay. For one so damage. So 23 hits. For one damage. Yeah. Yeah, so unfortunately the bullet just bing, bounces off. I mean, 21 hits it, but you're going to have to do more damage than that to puncture Should've through. Should have full attack. So. Hang on. I'm, full attack. I'm looking at this. The, the damage has sickened on it as well. It's a rifle. That shouldn't make a difference for the, the, how much damage the bullet it's does. The condition of the game is a minus two to all damage attacks. Really? Wow. Okay. It's everything. Yep. It's minus two to literally like the like anything you can I do. Guess, my like, whole character sheet has a minus two so on it right now. Not as good a hit or something. My whole yep. fucking character okay. sheet. So. Oh, mine too, buddy. Yeah. So I look back at the prisoners because I'm like against this wall kind of mm-hmm. where some prisoners are. And I'm like, just not feeling good. And I'm like be with y'all in just a second. No, the, actually, the lizard folk right next to you is just like violently like smashing around the, the her cell, just just like, like kind of freakily so, like looks really agitated and almost feral. Great. Great um, info. Nothing I can do about right. it right now. That's my turn. All right, Elenia is going to try to shoot Ziva. All right, we're looking at an 18 to hit you for two damage. Oh, okay, fine. That, yes, I take that. All right, Xena, let me get a fortitude save. 14. That is not enough. I'm sorry. That is enough. That is enough. Can I shout that is reaction? The, the, the roof? Like, or yes. on the ceiling or whatever? Yeah. You know? Okay. All right. So yes. let him know. So you have, you, Orin has pointed out the sonic debilitator to all of you. You are still sickened. I'm sorry. You're not sickened, Zeno. That was enough to save. Nice. But I do take one bleed damage. Just you do take one bleed off. damage. Yep. All right, so I'm at six stamina. I am going to go ahead and uh, taking uh, Oren's uh, quick info tip, I'm going to go ahead and swing my uh, assault rifle towards where he's pointing at. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and do a full attack from where I'm standing onto that uh, on that sonic emitter or sonic depilitator. Okay. Full attack? Yes. Full attack. I rolled a 13 on the first and a 12 on the second. Okay. How much damage for both of those? 13. I mean, uh, the 13 rolled a 6, five, uh, 5 for the 12. So that's 11 total. 11. Okay. If both those shots go through. Contact. Nice. And so it's still still functioning, but you get a, a solid hit on it. Um, and, you know, you, you see that you can get through. And then after that, I'm going to uh, make a, a quick shout out to Fell, and it's like Fell behind you. Uh, okay, Mike, roll a fortitude save. <clears throat> All right, twenty-three. You're good. Tight. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Now that I've dispatched the enemy nearest me. Uh, I'm gonna go in the direction that I see my enemies shooting toward, or my friends, not my enemies, uh, shooting okay. towards. Let me see if I have. I've got 40 feet. Can there we... is a door right here? Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I'll just go through the door then. Well, you can't go through it because it's blocked by the enemy, but you can at least get right up in his grill. I, I want to hit him with the door that I kick open. Yeah, that's not going to happen. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I do that. <clears throat> and then uh, okay. I'm going to punch him. 19? That's going to hit. For 13 bludgeoning damage. Nice. Solid hit there, Mike. All right. Uh, P- Paviata is like, what? What? He, like, did not expect you to come blasting through that side door. Um, and is going to turn... Call tapioca. Is going to turn on you and hit, try to hit you with a tack lash. 14's going to miss, right? You're fucking right it is. Because of this All right, new armor. and... Oh, uh, yeah. An 8's going to miss, too. So, you 
dodge both whip attacks. Fell. Fortitude save. Okie dokie. Uh, that's a 12. Okay. I'm still sickened? You are still sickened, yes. Neat. Uh, I'm going to keep shooting at the guy that I shot at before. All right. Six. That's a miss. That's a miss. And then uh, fall back further into the room next to Oren. Okay, good. All right, Ziva. Okay, does she have to roll anything? No. Do I automatically become unsickened? Correct. Oh, yeah. Shuck it dang darn. Um, okay, and what? she... Don't what worry about it. <laughs> don't even worry about it. <laughs> so, she's a little miffed because this bitch just shot her. Um, so she's gonna say, I've seen enough of this. And she's going to move across the room towards her, and as she does so, is going to call inevitable downfall to her hands and bring it down <laughs> out hopefully. of Mike's hand. He is out of Mike's hand. He's like, what the fuck? <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> he Mike just like hands. looks at his hand for a second like what the fuck <laughs> oh that's right that's right and let's All right. see Ooh. fucking A oh man it, it came from too far not away she was, her hands were slippery yeah. seven. seven it's not gonna hit no, uh, no, I, I, tr- but I trained great. you better than that it's the I sword's feel like, fault I feel like it yeah. should intimidate this girl because a fucking sword just magically right. appeared. All right, you're up. Well, that's rude. Yeah, I hear, I hear you, but you <laughs> just, just whipped you. really bad. So, yeah. So, Oren, Oren, Oren's save. gonna say out of the side of his mouth to the lizard folk person who's freaking out as he takes aim. Can you not? I'm trying to focus here, and I'm gonna take a, a double attack <laughs> at the thing. Fortitude save first. Oh, of course. Yeah, it's still sick. (laughs) Alright, full attack on the Sonic Disruptor. Six misses, right? It does. Does a 14 hit? It hits. For three damage? That damage does not go through. Oh, it's got a dim. It's got a DR. It's got a DR. Son of a bitch. This is bad. Okay. Alright, that's my turn. Alright, Elena is going to drop the pistol and go for a tack lash on you. Natural 20. That's right. stupid. Boo. That's three so far, right? Um, for you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see, to confirm. 19 to confirm. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's Fuck. get that card. <laughs> All right, so critical hit card. It's kinetic with the uh, attack lash. It is yeah. run away. Bonus effect. <laughs> the attack has the automatic weapon special property. Huh? I don't see how that's going to work that's out. for kinetic. Huh? It is... just means that you... <clears throat> that's only apple. Does it mean that guns. these... Right. Yeah, that's it's not good. Oh, Next darn. Card. That, hap- no. that, no, that happens not. sometimes. That's like, what, sometimes yeah, you that, get lucky on the cards like that. However, you do take 11 points of damage. Oh, no. I don't... Fuck that bitch. <laughs> uh, Zeno. Mm. Let me get that fortitude save, buddy. How about no? Well, you're trying so to get rid of the second. Fortitude. You are no longer sickened with a 21, 21. on that dice. All right. Yeah, yeah. All right. So I am going to full attack. I'm just going to keep on firing at that Sonic Debilitator. All right. First, okay, attack, first attack, 16. Right. Second attack, 18. All right. They Total both of, hit. Uh, I know. So we're going to do damage one damage. time. So the 16 does All how right. much damage? Seven. All right, that goes through for seven damage. All right. All right, and then the second attack? It was an 18 for four damage piercing. That does not go through. Bounces okay. off. We're, we're figuring out what the DR is, uh, folks. Five. Uh, yeah, okay, five. so it's not DR. It's hardness. 
So you you ah, have to you have okay. to be a certain threshold of damage for it to count. Otherwise, it doesn't do anything. It's still still there, but it's starting to short out a little bit. Mike, fortitude save. Twenty. Uh, yeah, you're not sick. Nope. Um, yeah, I'm going to, uh, just keep, keep on, keep on keeping on with the punchy boy All right. stuff. <laughs> what was that? Uh, get out of here. Not about you. <laughs> Thirteen. <laughs> Probably not gonna hit. That does hit. Does it? For twelve it does. bludgeoning damage. And you knock Paviata's face into her skull. Yeah, fuck that bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um, I just like off to the corner. The, <laughs> fuck that the, bitch. the lizard folk starts jumping up and down like... <laughs> and, um, and you see Grub kind of starts mm. slithering around in, in Wait, itself. What? A giant caterpillar, caterpillar getting... Uh, they're starting to get excited. The, I feel like I missed that grub. Oh, okay. 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 All right. Fell. Fortitude save. Okie dokie. Nope. That's a five. Still sick. And he's seen these guys shoot at the disc thing in the ceiling and is going to do the same thing now that his previous target is dead. I'm going to attack with the uh, overcharge. And that's a miss. What'd you roll? A nine. Oof. Yeah. Yeah, that's a miss. Okay, Ziva, you're toe to toe with the last remaining guard in this room. Yeah. She's been fucking your shit up. She has indeed been. She's been being real rude to me, so um, we are gonna go for a full attack. Oh please. Oh, garbage! Just fucking garbage! Just kill me! Oh my god! What'd you roll? I don't want to say. Careful what you wish for. No, I take that back. Can you just edit that out? What'd you roll? Ten and a five. Uh huh. Yeah, okay. It's no good. No good. Oren, let me get that fortitude save. Alright, coming right up. Uh, six. <laughs> <laughs> Or can catch a break. <laughs> okay. Oh, damn. Um, I don't know. I mean, the DR is five. I've got a negative two to my damage. I can only roll an eight. Like, it's just so such a bad. It's it's just not like a, a an ideal full attack. The sonic disruptor. I don't have another a better option. Ten and a fourteen. And uh, so the. T- the they both Point, hit, but the dr doesn't go through. So or the hardness doesn't go through. So. Just tell me what you rolled. Stop making assumptions. Ten for five piercing damage and fourteen for four that goes through, damage. bro. The five damage goes through. Does ten and hit? And you just ten hits. Okay. For five damage, and you see the thing explode. Yes. <laughs> nice. And cascade down oh, in a series yeah. of sparks. Noise, noise. Fear is the mind killer. You know what I'm saying? Like I was already defeated before I, I started. I hear you. Fuck yeah. Struggle. Nice. Nice. Am I no longer sickened? Uh, you won't be next round. Okay. All right. Cool deal. <sighs> Orin breathes a sigh of relief, though. Okay. Elenia is up. Let's see if I can get another nat twenty on you. No, but I think I'm going to get a hit. 17. Fucking whatever. God. <laughs> uh, for six damage. Ziva. Ziva's at zero. Your s- zero stamina. Zero stamina. stamina. It still scares health. me, though. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, right. you're fine. Zeno, you're up. Like huh. Zeno. Hmm. I suppose Zeno's just gonna kind of just move around, just get a better, get a get a better picture. He's gonna roll a perception. Um, see if there's a, a, any of these control panels or anything like that. I don't see any more foes uh, in my view right now. And let's get that perception. We're just gonna let Ziva die trying to solo this guard 
instead of yeah oh shit yeah. i mean you're not really seeing anything i'm not seeing anything specific okay. yeah okay mike here i come to save the day um <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah i'm gonna go through the door and go and uh protect my captain and uh you can get right behind you can get her basically right behind her wow <clears throat> But there's nothing I can do from right behind her. I just oh, I can get I'll in there get at there. least. I appreciate your moral support. <laughs> okay. You can bodyguard <laughs> now. Oh, that's right. She she freaked me out because she said she I'm at zero. It's like you're at zero stamina. You're fine. Yes. <clears throat> I come behind her little... and I'm just waiting to do the seatbelt mom. You know, from behind. Like, <laughs> <laughs> that's <for> my baby. <laughs> All right, fell. <laughs> uh, Fel's gonna roll to attack his M. <laughs> Shit, I can't remember. If I'm still sick, and so I need to roll it for it, right? No, the thing's gone. You can't attack. Oh, dead. Nothing to do with it. Yeah, okay. uh, yeah, I shot it down. I don't know how I missed that. Um, yeah, he's gonna see Mike run through that door and try and do the same. Why can't I? That's not a door, there, is it? Yeah, it is. It is. I got you. Okay. So I can just barely get in because my heavy ass armor and uh, weak little old legs and shoot at the last prison guard with an eight on the attack, and that is a miss. Oh, oh my god. All right, yeah. Ziva, come on. Come on, Ziva. Is this bitch made of mist or something? Like, I can't hit her. I don't know. I think you just can't swing. Probably. You're just you're just not good at attacking. That's not an inaccurate statement. Here we go. Use your movement to get him. It's too late now. 19. 19. That will hit. Five. How much damage? Five shit damage. Okay. All right. Sorry. I have a movement left. Uh-huh. Get him. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Um, yeah, they you, they so. definitely look like they're not controlled at the cell. You know what I mean? Okay. Do they look like they're controlled via the center console that's in the center of the room? Um, I, that is that like? Just... I mean, is that like? In, there's not insight. <laughs> that would be making an yeah. assumption. Yeah. There's the, the yeah. I would like to you roll have to, to move up there. You know, none of you have to roll for that. Just take 20 on it. Yeah, y'all take 20 on that every day. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to delay my turn. Okay. Elenia is going to try to continue to fuck up Zevo. Well, if she... Okay, that's a hit. Just to, if she hits, I'm That's a 20. Guarding. It's not a nat 20, but it's a 20 hmm. to hit. So you're going to bodyguard? I mean, it doesn't matter. You're not okay. 18 AC, right? Me? No. Yeah. Good Lord, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's a hit for seven damage. Oh, God, no. Okay. <laughs> I tried. Zeno. All right, so Zeno is going to try to... He, he's going to look at some of these cages uh, that, that the feral beasts are appearing, appearingly feral. Um... And he's just gonna uh, just perceive what he can about this with an uh, eight. Yeah, you can't see through. Yeah, it's just you just see this lizard folk just like smashing itself up against the up against and and do any of yeah, I don't think any. Let me see here. Well, from the perception, can I at least? I mean, like, are they in the individual cages? You rolled an you rolled an eight, so you can't glean anything. Okay. Um. However, you hear it, it's like shouting in a crazy language that you don't understand, but you do hear the word. Well, actually, does anybody speak Akatonian? I do. Uh, actually? Ziva does. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, uh, I do as well. You see um, this Akeshti just like smashing up the thing, like, and speaking in Akatonian, going, Foul! Scum, foul. Like, like, just trying to throw itself towards Orin. Oh. Like, it's. Oh. oh. Oh, it thinks that I'm Aslanti. <laughs> All right, Mike. 
Uh, Mike's in a weird position because he's behind Ziva, so and he doesn't have a ranged weapon. What is how how big is this thing next to me? It's a, just a regular desk. It's yeah, so I can just move some use some movement to hop up on the desk. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do that. Okay. And uh, <clears throat> I don't know. I guess punch down at the top of her head. <laughs> Just try to smash right through the top of her head. <laughs> yeah, basically, yeah. All right, come on, Mike. Critical fail. Oh, oh fuck! Wow. Like Roll to confirm. <laughs> I was doing so good. I killed everybody oh. else. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, what if you accidentally punch Ziva? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, now you put it out in the air, you asshole. <laughs> Aren't you the one that's always saying, man. I'm not trying to kill you? You're giving us bad voodoo. <laughs> what's, what's the card? Roll to confirm. Roll to confirm first. I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, it does not confirm, so you just miss. Whew, all right. Yeah, it's a weird angle, you know. <laughs> Alright, Phil. <laughs> Alright, uh... I don't really have a good shot at this guy. Um... Fell is going to... use... Uh, let's see, Harrying Fire on him. Okay. To try and give a plus two circumstance bonus to the next person to attack him. You need to hit an AC of 15. Okay. So let's see. Come on, fifteen. Nine. Oh. <laughs> hey, good job. Yeah, that was good, that was good definitely use. a good attempt. Yeah, the fell I tried. just shoots up the ceiling like. Get up! <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen. And, I just uh, say he can't say get him. That's trademarked. <laughs> no. I, I, after you, you finish your turn, fell. But then I, I have something I have to point out. Sure. You finish sure. Your turn. And uh, fell. Bell is going to kind of like huff a little bit, be like, God "Damn it!" and just leave this room and go see what Zeno uh, is doing, or Zeno and Oren are up to. <laughs> he just pulls a "We'll see ya." Like I'm done. Yeah. With it. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. I mean, like this little Aslanti guard huddled in a corner with three of our party members. <laughs> literally, just backed him into a corner, her into a corner, whoever it is, has survived. Three times as long as the Aeon fucking guard that we just yes. <laughs> obliterated. Wow. It's yeah. the greatest moment of her uh, life. Roll better, it, guys. It's okay. it, a heroic death for this Aslanti prison guard, for sure. <laughs> All right, Ziva. Come on. Come on, Ziva. Ziva is going to. I like pat you on the shoulder from the desk. Ziva's going to, like, put her sword towards, like, pointing at this guard and say, I will get you. She's really fucking frustrated at herself. So that's a get him. And then mm -hmm. let's see. Please, for the love of God, please. Fucking A, 13? Wait, so 15. That's, gonna be a plus. that's a hit, though. Well, it's not 15, it's 14. Nah, his, his uh, herring fire didn't work. Uh, my bae. But get him But your get him does work, yeah. so it gives you a plus one. So that's a 14 mm -hmm. that hits. For six? And you kill oh, Elena. God. Oh, God. Oh, all, God. The all the prison guards are dead. <sighs> You've used three minutes total at this point. And we'll see you. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Ooh, dude. Oh, boy. What the fuck? You know what? Good. Good. <laughs> I need to see you. How about that? Holy bye. crap, man. Bye. This has just been like. This episode has been sponsored by Roll20. This is how we roll. <laughs>